The only thing I don't really like about those adjustments I made was it, it did make it quite a bit looser on entry. Yeah, well, you know what? I'm doing most of my braking on the straightaway anyway, like I was telling you. So I'm braking in a straight line. Yeah, and that's really what you want to do, so. I am in the race server. And we got 14. Copy that. 14 cars, 40 laps. Track is 78 degrees. And that's another thing we need to do is, what was it, what were we practicing at? I know, yeah, because I was thinking about that last night when I got on, when I ran my two. Because really, you can't go based off the times on different track uh, conditions. All right. Looks like it's clear. Well, I don't know, this is just the loading screen, I guess. Are you going to queue it up? No. no. Just qualify. No. Don't worry about yourself. So that would have been a 4x that I sent you, that I sent you yesterday. That would have been what, huh? I just sent you two pictures on uh, Messenger. Would you say that would have been a 2 or a 4x? <laughs> oh, let me look. Oh, and when I asked for pics of that billboard, he just sent me the same... Yeah, I know. <laughs> It's actually only like 20 minutes away from me. We used to have uh, friends who lived up there, but they moved down to uh, Florida. Sold the house, so I don't have any reason to go up there now. So he got the ticket, I assume? There was no tickets written. So. But the insurance company called me today, and they found him 100%. Well, at least my insurance company did. Right, they said, nah, it's his fault. Because yeah, because even if you look, I don't know if I sent you the picture, but if you look at the first picture I sent you last night, you'll see that all four of his tires are in my side of the road. Liter literally, all four of his tires are on my side of the road. Did you, you took a lot more pictures than this, right? No, that's all I got. I, I've already yeah. spoken to the insurance company. They were like, yeah, so we thought that there may have been like split blame, but you know, the skid marks going over your side of the road... You don't need much more than that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, how how could he even how could he even say that it was even remotely your fault? Well, so the first thing I said to him was like, you know, are you all right? When I got out of my car, and he was first thing he said to me was, oh, you should have been looking, yada yada yada. So this is basically what happened. Um, I was the yellow box. I was parked in that spot, backing out to sort of make like a K turn out of the parking lot, or like a reverse K turn out of the parking lot. Yeah. And then you could see you know, where he was coming in. Uh, okay. So they said there's no two questions about it. Yeah, it looks like he wasn't even using the lanes correctly. No, he wasn't. He was in. he was coming in at a 45 degree angle. Right. And, he been coming in yeah. the and to leave skid marks on, you know, entering a parking lot? Come on. <laughs> yeah. HHR, huh? The homo hot rod. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've never heard. Of You've never that. heard that it called that. <laughs> no. I've never known anybody well until now that had an HHR. Yes, that's that's what I coined it. The homo hot rod. Homo hot rod. <laughs> that's hilarious. <laughs> you know, I'm never gonna mention that. I'm never going to mention you by name when I tell people about that. <laughs> but I am going to tell people about that. <laughs> I got a buddy. He lives in New Jersey. <laughs> like, 
I got a gay friend that drives this truck. He calls the Homo Hot Rod. <laughs> That's fucking hilarious. That's what I coined it the day I got it. Yeah, I've never named any of my cars. Not even the Pontiac? No, nope. you know what I called it? The Grand Am. It's exactly what it was. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I call my Trailblazer? The Trailblazer. See, I would think you would have a, na a name for the Trailblazer with as much as you've souped that thing up. No, I never name them. As much them. detailing as you've done to it. The problem is, once you name them, then it takes... You become piece. attached. Right. Yeah, my Saturn was Old Faithful. Because that thing took me everywhere. Got it with 137,000 miles on it and drove it to 240,000 miles on it in a matter of two and a half years. Um, and then my Elantra was the shit box because literally every week something was wrong with that thing. Well, it was a Hyundai. Yeah, I know. I'm never going to buy another Hyundai again. So, my mom still drives my Grand Am. You know, I'm the number three um, car in here. Oh, you better finish in the top five then, or you're going to lose I rating. You think I care? Yeah. I just want to get on here, <laughs> run some Legends races, maybe run some late models, maybe run some dirt, maybe run some trucks. Actually, let me turn my fan on real quick, because it's about 3,000 degrees in here. The problem is, is you want to run against clean drivers that aren't fucking idiots. So you want to care about your eye rating at least a little bit. <laughs> What'd you say while I was walking away? So the problem is, you you want to race with clean drivers and not idiots. So you want to care about your eye rating a little bit. Eh. You're the only one that has a spotter. Or, or is that just me and you can see that? No, because I saw somebody else had the check mark next to their name. Right. So where am I rolling off? Okay. Twelfth. Outside. Second to last. Row. My six is it. Well, um, you know what, come to think of it, I'm hoping that it uh, automatically loads your last setup. <laughs> uh, if that's what you had in last, that's what should be loaded. Okay. You'll know, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure I will. As soon as it plows center off, you'll know. Actually, as soon as you get to the end of the straightaway and you're in the rev limiter, you'll know. Or the, yeah. Yeah. I was hitting the rev limiter. I guess just let me know, uh, you know, 10, 20, 30 laps. Because I didn't even realize right. that we only had like two laps to go in the dirt race. But Yeah, I was going to try to give you 10 to go, but it was already like 7 to go. <laughs> Yeah, I'll try to stay on top of that this time. Okay. All right, let's go. Rolling. Can you see my tires or anything or no? Like, well, do, do you have nah. full crew chief or? I'm just no. Well, I don't know. Just pick the spot. No. Oh, okay. Well, like, I got to know if you could. Because I know they do have a thing where if you're running like a an open setup race as a crew chief, you can I can tell you do two tires and change the pressures in them, and you have the ability to do that. But I don't know if that's only for you, C's, you have, B's, and A's. I'm pretty sure you have my setup loaded. My modified setup. So you should be good to go. Okay. 
I just clicked on the garage and it said set up from Tom Richter, so I'm assuming that's it. Okay. We'll see. Alright. Get a drink. That's what I plan Ready. on doing after this race one, because this is probably going to be my last one. I'm... Is there somebody blinking up there? No. Everybody looks fine. Race car's off. Get ready. Get ready. They're banging already. Green, green, green. Inside. 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 Clear. They're all around. Outside, at your door. Outside, quarter. Clear. Watch these guys in front of you. Too wide in front of you. Whoa, big wreck. That was Clear. help. <laughs> I gotta say, that was very helpful, big wreck. <laughs> oh, I mean. There wasn't much I could do. They all wreck out of the way anyway. Outside. 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 Four's looking to make a move on ya. He's looking outside. 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 Are we three? Outside. Nope. Too wide. Outside. Order. Clear. Coming to lap five. Go low. Ins outside. 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 Three wide. Three wide. Outside. Clear. Or no. Uh, outside. Outside. Clear. Uh, go in the middle. In the middle. There, they're all around. all this car down on the inside smoking pretty bad he's on the apron tracks clear tracks clear outside outside quarter outside outside door to door outside clear is he blinking or am I he's, he's blinking he is blinking Third. All right. Leaders in front of you. Two up. Let's go get them. Lap nine. Plenty of time. Getting a little free off. Do you want lap times? Oh, watch up here. Looks like the leader is loose. Give me, uh, give me the leader in May.
Okay. Twenty one eight for you. Leaders in the fours. Last lap was a six. Looking for two tenths. I have a feeling a lot of these guys are, I have a feeling these guys are gonna come backwards. Yep, looks like they're all loosening up in front of you. I'm just driving. I'm not even really pushing. All right, that's good. Last lap was a seven. Oh, watch. Stay low, stay low. Go high, go high. All right, All right just clear, me clear. and the leader. Nice work. I like the way you pass cars. Lap 16. Coming to 17 right here. We were at a nine. The leader ran a five. Does he look like he's getting loose at all or? You watch him. Yeah, I got nobody around me. You're good for now. Uh, he, he looks pretty hooked up. And he's okay. consistently in the fours. Last couple laps were in fours. What was he running? Well, can uh, I guess you can't see that. Yeah, he's uh, 21 fours mostly. Looks like six and a five. He was probably passing somebody. Car looks good though. Yeah, solid. Little free. Comfortable free. Oh, I was talking about his car. Oh. He's, <laughs> he's solid on the gas almost from center off. He, I don't think he's feathering it at all. Yeah, I definitely am. But hey, we'll take a second if that's where we finish. I think that's too much right rear spring. Probably did that. Can you see the deltas or no? Uh, I don't think so. Not even if you hit like F1 or F2, whatever. Um, I don't know if it gives you that option as a spotter. Oh, I can click to become crew chief though. Uh, did the leader? No, somebody just disappeared. Wouldn't that be nice, huh? Leader just as <laughs> Right. <laughs> Your best lap is lap 10, 21-5. You are constantly in the nines, though. You are running nines like no one's business. Does the crew chief give you more information, or what does that do? I can do your pit stop if you, if you need oh, to okay. one. And make all your adjustments. If you were to pit. Obviously we're not pitting, so. Uh, 
14 to go. 14 to go, my bad, 14. Should be coming at 10 to go. Can you see my tire wear or no? Or at least tire temps. No. I would like to know, after the race though, just pop in the garage real quick. Well, I just switched over, it's showing all my tires at 78 degrees and 100%. Yeah, it doesn't show you your tire wear until after your pit stop. Oh, okay. So it's not like uh, NR? No. Alright, gotta start watching this guy behind me, he's gaining a tiny bit. Not enough, I don't think, to catch us within these next eight laps, but... Your last lap was a two, his was a one. Okay. We're talking about the guy behind me, right? Yeah, it's the 10 car, right? Yeah. Yeah, he's beating you by about half a tenth. Not enough. Just keep your pace up. You gotta be fine. It wouldn't hurt to try to get back in the nines, though. Uh, we ain't gonna catch the leader. So, little... Little free center off, but uh, otherwise it feels good. I mean, obviously I'm kind of just throttling it, but... Good lap. 0-1. Clear? Oh yeah, you got like a straightaway on him. You'll be fine. Two to go. Two to go, two to go. Well, this would have been a walk away if we didn't have the leader, you know. Yeah. Yeah, if that guy wouldn't have been in this race, you'd have smoked these dudes. Yeah. And on an open setup too. That's uh, you know, but this is very promising. This is uh, I need to... this is uh, you know, giving us a lot of room to work.
to the line. All right, good job. 40 clean. Make sure you get off the track without some dumbass hit, yeah. <laughs> Has that ever happened to you? Yeah. It just happened to me the other day. Right after the race was over, I got ran up the track and fucking smashed into the wall. You ran a... You ran a 0x race and then... <laughs> yep, and then 2x right at the end. And it still counts that? Yeah, because oh. the last car hadn't crossed the start finish line yet. No. Oh. I want to go back and see... Uh... Wish there was a quick Tire wear. Oh, uh, where do you oh, see I'm that? I'm at it right now. 221, 221.98%. So. You did have more tire wear in the rear than the front, so. Obviously, that means it was loose. Yeah, I mean, it, it was very, very tolerable. Um, but, uh, you know, I think we can. Maybe lower the air pressure in the right rear a little bit. Or, or yeah, I mean, it, it was it was definitely drivable. Um, only got loose a handful of times, but but that felt solid. I gotta say.